can't wait to leave this place. Brookhaven's disgusting, and I need a vacation. What I deserve. I've been the best Karen in the whole universe, and I could just use a break. You know, a little sand between my toes, just relaxing, Oceanside. You! Stop right there! You're under arrest! Excuse me? Who are you? I'm a police officer. And Karen, you are under arrest. Yeah, we've had enough of you terrorizing this town, Karen. Put your hands up now. No, I'm not putting my hands up. I need to speak with your manager right away. No, there's no more speaking to the manager. You're going downtown, Karen. I want to speak with the manager right away. I need to get what I want, and this is unfair. Too bad, Karen. I can't believe this. Look, I'm in an orange jumpsuit like a prisoner. Orange is not my color. You know, I really need to speak to the warden about changing the color of these inmate uniforms because honestly, orange just does not complement the way I look. I mean, why can't they be striped or like purple or pink, something more happy? Instead, it's gross orange. Ugh, I can't believe this. Hey, you, stop complaining. Excuse me? Who are you to think you could speak to me that way? Look, lady, we're all in here in prison, and none of us want to hear you complain about absolutely everything. You got that? It's a tough time as it is. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You're coming over here and trying to tell me to be quiet? What's next? You're going to tell me to calm down? Uh, no, no. You know what? Fine, whatever. Just... Don't yell so much, all right? No, I do what I want. I'm in charge here, and you're going to have to like it. But hey, uh, I, I was wondering, can mail be delivered here? Yeah, I think so. But you got to know somebody. Hmm, all right. Well, I need to write a few letters to the president and to the manager and the Senate. So, uh, yeah, I want these letters mailed out. You got that? Or sure, whatever, lady. Shines, it's so nice to have that Karen's lady finally in Yale, y'all. I mean, things can go back to Norman's. I could go and get like 10 burritos, and then you can make some steaks, and I'll have some of those, and we can go back to Norman Loft. Thank goodness, dude. Okay, Karen has been so mean to everybody in Brookhaven. I'm tired of it, Officer Rufus. I know, Brookhaven's be like the nicest place, and like the mean peoples, we not having it, y'all. You know what else is super nice? Everyone that bought the Shame Place plushie. Did you know that it's already almost out of stock again it's gonna sell out like pretty soon shines that is wild y'all yeah i know everybody that doesn't have one should definitely pick one up because i don't know if we're ever gonna have them again well i'm glad i got like five of them because that means that i'll have them forever y'all that's a smart move officer rufus and Wait a minute, dude, the doorbell. Were you expecting someone? Um, that could be like the pizzas that I ordered because I was really hungry, y'all. Awesome, dude, let's go get that pizza. Whoa, dude, it's a note. It's from Karen. It says, this is only the beginning. Oh no. This is perfect. We gotta get out of here. Now's our time. Huh. I'm so glad we got out of here. And you know what? I am ready to get rid of anyone, and I mean anyone, who stands in my way. Whoa, Karen. <laughs> How do you plan on doing that exactly? Oh, well, you see, funny thing is, is I know plenty of managers, and I got good connections around here. And I can get the people who wronged me in trouble, and in deep trouble. Whoa. Well, note to self, I am never going to mess with another Karen ever again. And honestly, good luck with that. <laughs> Oh, don't you worry. I don't need luck. All right, Karen. Well, you probably should get going, and I should too. I mean, we're breaking out of prison, and uh, we're totally going to get caught if we just stand here and keep talking. Oh, oh yeah, you're right. Okay, let's get out of here. All right, you see over there? That two-teeth freak officer Rufus lives there. He just left. So I think it is time we burn down his house. <laughs> yeah, Officer Rufus lives in a tree. What a loser. That'd be so easy. We could even cut it down if we wanted to. Turn it into a real house. No, I told you I want it burnt down, so you need to burn the house down. Fine, jeez. Last time I bring up a suggestion. All right, whatever. You know what? On second thought, I don't want you doing this. This is my revenge, so I'm gonna burn it down. Me. Ha! I'm the top criminal around here. 
It's almost like I'm the criminal manager. Wow, kind of like the sounds of that. So when people complain, they gotta talk to me? <laughs> this is great. I feel absolutely invincible. And that Shane and his little ragtag group of friends, ah, they will never see it coming when I unleash my power. Uh, hi, Karen. I was wondering, uh, I know that you're the boss now and I have to ask you everything, so I was wondering, can I go to the bathroom? I don't know, can you? <laughs> See, you're supposed to say, may I go to the bathroom? And no, you can't. You gotta get me an espresso first and don't make it too hot. It needs to be a perfect 98 degrees and if it tastes too much like espresso, you're in trouble. I'll try. This is like the fourth espresso I've tried to get you this week. Every time I go to the coffee shop, they give me exactly what you ask for and you say that it's wrong. Are you trying to tell me that I don't know what I want in this world? Uh, no, Karen, no. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'll go take care of it right away. Perfect. I'm glad. I am just so stressed out though, because now everyone in this world has failed to stop Shane and Rufus. And it's time for me to step in and actually do the job. Where would this world be without a Karen like me? Ugh, well, whatever. Okay, so you gotta run inside and go upstairs to the vault, blow up the vault and rob Shane for every single penny that he has. And also take his YouTube plaques he doesn't need him. He's the worst YouTuber ever. Oh, I don't know, Karen. I actually kind of like his videos. I subscribe to his channel. I think everybody should. Be quiet. Oh, the sound of your voice just gives me a headache. Time's wasting. Tick tock. I don't know. This might not be good. Whatever, I'll do it. I know Shane's really smart. Hey, stop trying to rob me, dude. Ugh. No, it's you! Karen, how did you get out of jail? Get back here! Oh, would you look at that little guy over there? Oh, he's so cute, that little fluffy Wapkins. Oh, I love him. Look at him. He's on his phone. I wonder if he's texting his friends. Oh, that's adorable! Oh my gosh! Oh, well, you know what? I'm finally gonna capture him. He's gonna be my best friend forever and this time he's gonna like it man it's so nice out today I can't wait to go skateboard with shane it's gonna be awesome look don't move oh, i'm not dealing with this again take this ah! no oh my gosh oh thank goodness that really worked these fire extinguishers are awesome <laughs> all right cool i gotta go do something else this is getting boring i am just so aggravated i am so mad everyone is useless Ugh. I can't count on them for anything. It's time for the ultimate chaos, and I am not gonna play nice anymore. You stop right there, Karam lady, okay? It's all over for you now. What? Ugh, it's you, the two-teeth freak. What are you doing here? I may have two teeth, but I is not a freaks, y'all, okay? I'm here to put you in the world's most strongest prisms on the world, y'all. No. No, no, you can't do that. Listen here, lady, okay? You've been causing lots of wild things in towns, and I've had it up to here, okay? You're gonna be under arrest for the last dime, and you go into prisms, y'all, and that's that. However, you don't know that I actually put a bomb in this house just in case you were gonna walk in. I had a feeling you were gonna try and stop me. Oh, no, that's not right. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Catch you later, loser. Hold on, wait a minute, that woman was lobs. There was no bombs in that house. Ugh, could this airplane be any slower? I can't believe this. It is eating up my precious time. Ugh, this is so annoying. But you know what? I could complain to the manager and get a free ticket. <laughs> I'll be jet setting all over this world. All right, Karen, it's time for you to go back to jail. Oh, no, 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 no. Ha, you see, I'm not going back to jail. It's my time to shine. I'm gonna go make a big speech about how I'm the greatest in the whole world and no one, and I mean no one, will be able to handle the power of me complaining. <laughs> Karen, we never want you to come back to Brookhaven. You know what? I'm gonna do whatever I want and you can't stop me. I mean, look at you. You're dressed like a freak. Hey, that's really mean. I got this shirt out of the Shane Place store for 15 Robux. It's an incredible deal. No. 
terrible deal. And that's just, oh, 15 Robux? Who would pay that? My gosh, would you just stop? Just shut up. My goodness, you're just mean to everybody. Don't you get tired of being angry all the time? Just get out of here. We don't want you around anymore. You're just being mean to everyone. Oh, my God. No one has ever talked to me like that before. Oh, my gosh. I'm out of here. I can't handle the sadness.